Going back to playing days, trying to sustain a high level of performance in finals is it's hard and easy in, in some respect as well because hard's actually getting it done but easy is the motivational part so I think when finals come around it's it's what you work for so the motivation is should be there and, and come to you quite easily but the the consequences and the ramifications of poor performance is, is the hard part. mindset I've tried from a coaching point of view is to never forget what it was like as a player and that can be difficult at times because the game changes and certainly from when I played to now it, the game is different and, and the whole environment's different so I think you've got to be open to to learning and quite resilient because you know things are going to get thrown your way on a daily basis it's like a funnel and a lot of things are getting pushed straight to you and you know your decision making is, is really important. Um, you need to have trusted people around you because it can be quite demanding. You get challenged from different areas. The best advice you could give any young player in order to sustain high performance is to work hard and, and listen to people in the areas where you need to get better. And a lot of times that might be the physical department, it might be coaching, it could be in your off-field area, but I think that the trust in those around you and willing to take on feedback, and but also willing to give yourself. I think any high performing environment, if you're gonna get whatever you put in, you'll get it back. I think Stewie obviously has a extensive experience as a player uh, and achieved you know, the highest success um, through his football career and has translated that competitive nature um, into his coaching career and gets the most out of both players and staff with his competitive nature, drive towards success and, and continual motivation of the entire football program. To bring sustained performances to the Suns and trying to use my experiences as a player, I think as a player my career wasn't perfect, not many, not many are, but certainly I had some ups and downs and some challenges, different lived experiences. Um, you know, initially I, I lived in my home state but then moved interstate and had a a different experience there so I think you try and understand what the players are going through and I think that it's important to understand what's everyone's motivation that's the key to sustained performance because if it if it's you're not hitting the mark on that um, it always it might feel like a bit of a chore for some and we don't want that from anyone really we want them to maximize their potential